Today we're exploring this huge church in the Midwest. This place is so gorgeous. It has a huge dome, very beautiful woodworking details. It looks like somebody's been trying to restore this place. And I honestly thought this looked like it was from a different country. I don't know if you can hear the doves. There is a dove hiding in the woodworking. He's like in the roof. Look at that ceiling, it's so pretty. The beautiful stained glass. I wasn't even sure if I should do a video here because it's so small. It's gonna be a very quick video, but this place is so pretty, it, it deserves a video. This was really sketchy climbing up here. So somebody's been like replacing the wood so that way they could restore this because it is falling apart. The beautiful organs down there. The lights are really cool. All the detail. And then of course there's graffiti. But yeah, it's like plaster and lath up there. The very pretty detailed ceiling dome. Looked like there was a light in the center. It's not there anymore. This is the hole I had to come through. Pretty small. It says insert person. <laughs> so we're gonna go backwards out of this. Gotta switch, switch hands. This is what it looked like. So there's the ceiling. There's the floor, really short. And this all woodwork, this woodwork is like brand new. And what's even crazy is it's open. Like that's the roof, rooftop access. There is no hatch here, which means this wood is like getting rained on. Oh wow, you could actually climb to the top. If you're a climbing person, you could probably get some pretty cool shots up there. Sorry if it's a little shaky. I'm holding it with one hand while I'm holding the railing. It's really dark in here, mostly freshly built. Like this stuff looks older and then this stuff looks brand new. This stuff is kind of scary, <laughs> especially cause it's like creaking and some of the railings were like a little wobbly. Looks like whoever's restoring it though is doing a decent job. See, this is all fresh wood. I feel a lot more safe here. I'm gonna quickly go through this church for you guys. So over here, is a beautiful fireplace and an old piano. It's just tipped on its side. Uh, no, not the ladder. It does not work. It is completely broken. So you had to go up these steps and then right here, you had to cut through here because there is no door. So you just go through the wall. That was a door. It's kind of sealed off now.
And as you can see, like this is all brand new wood, I think, or newer wood. Like somebody's been slowly remodeling it. Like this stuff looks kind of new, some of it, some of it looks older. This stuff looks brand new. Then there's a piano over here. It says Kingsbury, Chicago. And it kind of works. Some of them don't, but some do. More stained glass. Beautiful woodwork right there. These are like sliding doors on tracks. Now this is where most photographers get the number one shot, the banger shot for this place. And it's like right here. Beautiful, beautiful shot. You got the dome, the lights right there, beautiful curves. You got the organ right there. But yeah, those chandeliers are gorgeous. The whole architecture, like this thing just looks like it's from a different country. I would have never expected this to be in the Midwest. And you can see how bad some of the wood is. But then if you look over here, right up in that corner, they have redone the roof. So that way they can save the church. Some beautiful stained glass. Then if you look over here, like the floor is starting to fall apart. And then there's like a stage right there where there is a cross etched into the wall. It's so pretty. You even got detail on the benches. If you look, there's a bunch of detail along the arch. I don't know if that's hand painted. I think it's hand painted. And it covers the entire archway. These steps safe over here to go down? Guess we'll find out. I mean, it's remarkable how well the wood has, like, lasted. Okay. It's a little sketchy, but I did make it. It does look like there's kind of holes over here. Okay, we're good. All the benches down here, the pews, I should say. Oh, no way. Oh, I thought those were keys. Those are actually nails. This was the entrance to it, all boarded up. This is the other stairwell. it looks like there's remnants of a couple people living here. Like it looks like people were sleeping on the benches. Absolutely breathtaking.
Got to be careful, there's holes in the floor. So this looks like where the Bible would be as they were preaching. This is the organ, which I think needs power to work, but it's pretty massive. Pedal, swell, great choir and echo. Oh, anything back there? Not really. There's woodworking details. Here's the cross I was talking about. Oh wow, back here was another homeless person. They were just kind of chilling back here. That's where they left all their garbage. And over here is probably the craziest thing. This was the entrance we had to take. And there is, the floor is literally collapsing on both sides. There's like no floor. The door had been kicked in and it's not even in the frame anymore. Like the whole frame and door moved, which is pretty wild. I have no idea how long it's been like that, but yeah. One of the best churches I have probably ever found, architectural-wise. It is so pretty. And it's all wood. This took a lot of time to build. And the fact that they're trying to restore it is wonderful. I hope it actually gets finished. Because that'd be a nice piece of history to keep. traveled down to the basement and I found a gym. I was not expecting that. But like the floor is just completely collapsing. That's so cool. All right, peace out guys. That's the end of this spot. The beautiful dome is up there.